been getting increasingly uh, angry, I think it'd be fair to say, enormously frustrated by US and Israeli government's barbaric acts in Gaza. I will not be shy in sharing that opinion on Piers Morgan's show today. Um, why are you so frustrated? Well, honestly, I, I didn't expect the framing that you put on this segment, and it's uh, framing like that that's disgusting. So I don't see what this has anything to do with anti-Semitism. I cry uh, for those Israeli innocent civilians. But do I see you guys crying for Palestinians? Because what, Palestinian lives don't matter? I think the real bigotry here is saying that Palestinians, we can kill three times as many of them already. And this is the appetizer. Netanyahu and his barbaric government have not even started the entree of murder and death and mayhem they're about to do. And that's somehow okay, killing three times as many Palestinian civilians, let alone the occupation, which is bigotry by definition. We say that everyone in the world can uh, defend themselves, can have their own state, can have sovereignty, except the Palestinians. And the reasoning behind that is the Palestinians are what? Uh, they're what? The idea is that they are savages and that Muslims are too violent and cannot control themselves. So they must be occupied for 56 brutal, disgusting years. So I've had enough of the bigotry against Muslims and Palestinians. And I need you to speak out against that instead of covering every outrageous, atrocious action of the right-wing government of Israel and going, oh, it's anti-Semitism. When, whenever Israel is criticized, you people go, oh, no, it's anti-Semitism. And me, instead of that, respond. instead of attacking that, all you guys mm. ever do is hide behind the veil of anti-Semitism. Do you know why well, Palestinians well, Jake, might not like Israelis? Because uh, they've been I oppressed jump, for respond. 56 straight years. I, Imagine writing the name of your child on their legs so that you could find them in the rubble after Israel or any government drops a bomb on them. I need the West to understand something. Bombs kill people. And do you know how they kill people? They incinerate them alive or their heads explode. But you have to be equally honest and, it, and equally outraged at the immorality of incinerating babies and grandmothers and aunts and uncles, which is what we're doing right now. America cannot you, Jake, keep sending you. aid for death and destruction. Enough of let the occupation. End it today. End it today. It's monstrous.